If you have listened to music on a Samsung Galaxy smartphone or tablet recently, then you are likely aware of the media notification that is displayed. This is present in the notification panel while the music is playing, and sadly it cannot be swiped away. Attempting to do so will result in nothing happening because Samsung has marked this as a persistent notification for you. We can't even long press on this notification to manually hide it either. Samsung has made sure that we see this notification every time music or video is playing on a media player application. But today I wanna to show you a free third party app that we can use to hide this notification for us. This free app does have an in-app purchase that is required if you want to hide the notification after a reboot. But other than that restriction, the app is free to use right now. And you don't have to pay for that in-app purchase if you are okay with manually hiding that notification after each reboot. So this application is called Tidy Panel and we can find it in the Google Play Store. You just have to search for Tidy Panel, all one word. But I will also be including a direct link to the app in the video description below for those who want an easier way to find it. So after the app has been installed, let's go ahead and open it up. And if this is your first time launching the app, it will ask you to grant it permission so that it can access your notifications. This permission is required for the app to be able to read and dismiss the notifications that you don't want to see. So with that permission granted, let's go ahead and start playing some music. So you can see we have music playing. This notification cannot be swiped away. However, whenever we go into the Tidy Panel app, we're going to look in this active notifications card right here. Now, if you don't see your media player app in this list, tap the refresh button so that it can collect and gather up the notifications. Once you see the notification that you want hidden, we're going to tap on it. And we get the option to choose how we want the notification to be blocked. We're going to be choosing the title option for this purpose, but you may get better results picking body or custom text here. Once one of these options has been picked, you should see that notification moved from the active notification card down to the hidden notifications card. And once that happens, we do not have that persistent notification in our notification panel either. We can check to make sure that the music is still playing. And even though that music is playing, we have nothing in our notification panel because it has been hidden with tidy panel. This notification will stay dismissed until you reboot the phone or remove it from this list here. If you manually remove it from this list, you should be aware that it can take some time before it will come back. So you may end up waiting 10 or 15 minutes for Android to display that notification again for you. And you can choose the apply on reboot toggle 
from the tidy panel app if you want this notification to always be hidden even after a reboot. Being able to use this feature does cost $1.99 as of recording this video and it needs to be paid for via the in-app purchase found on this page here. Now I'm not sure why Google and Samsung have designated certain apps the ability to have notifications that cannot be manually swiped away. But at least we have free apps like Tidy Panel that we can use to hide them from being displayed.